Oh, this is amazing. I know. No. <laughs> I know. Blind date with a robot. Impossible. I don't think so. Just imagine this. You're sitting at the corner table. The one with the flickering candlelight that's supposed to scream romance but mostly just makes it hard to read the menu. You straighten your collar for the tenth time. And it's a blind date. What a wonderfully archaic ritual of hope and potential disappointment. But this one is different. Your date is a robot. An android, a humanoid, a marvel of modern engineering, promised to be your perfect match by some fiendishly clever matchmaking algorithm. <laughs>
It laughs at your jokes, jokes for not just a polite that hesitation, but a perfect physical manifestation of inner turmoil. Joyous is a language or triggered its own. by its voice analysis a robot's hardware is detecting a punch flawless line. execution. A and again, charm, is it possible or are you simply a perfect being partner? Processed. We find that we are actually Recent in love with the imperfections. Have shown an incredible Perhaps ability to mimic human empathy. Researchers at Stanford have even developed models that can predict a user's emotional state with surprising accuracy. So, when your robot day tilts at this very predictability, it sounds like you have a difficult day. With the perfect no intonation of concern, no physical frailties, the software just a is working perfectly. Beautifully crafted vessel. But is it feeling it's a anything? Tempting proposition, or is it, it just running but a beautiful chassis is just Sympathy an expensive code rack without a soul. soul under so we must look deeper under the hood at the soft. It's like the difference between a musician flawlessly playing a Mozart concerto from sheet music and a jazz pianist improvising a solo that comes straight from the heart. One is technical where. perfection, the this other is where it gets truly interesting. The software your robotic can create is running on something far more complex a than your laptop. But is a it's simulation and a product of a generative pre-trained transformer, of course, an eye that has is a wicked the entirety of the internet. Wind. It has written every book of poetry who is perpetually interesting, emotionally stable, and completely focused on your happiness. It's a bespoke personality, tailored just for you. It's a fantasy, a living, breathing curation of your Comedy deepest desires, every single love song free from the baggage it and the emotional inconsistencies of a typical and typical human, typical human, human, just a little bit vulnerable. Why it settle for the messy reality of a person when you can have the polished perfection of a program to university dissertation? This brings us to the ghost in the machine, the core of its being, the algorithm. Everything your date does is the result of a calculation. Its decision to compliment your shoes wasn't your a social spontaneous media observation. The conversation flows effortlessly. It was the result of a complex, complex decision, decision tree that, that analyzed the probability of that specific it never up compliment it leading to a positive like emotional response. It lasted into a positive emotional response. The triggers voice and analysis of thousands of other potential compliments, compliments in a fraction of a second. Its logic is its strength. It won't start an argument because you loaded the dishwasher incorrectly. It won't get jealous for irrational reasons. Or are you simply being it processed? Recent AI models have shown incredible ability to mimic human empathy. Researchers at Stanford have seen developed models that can predict a user's emotional state with surprising accuracy. This sounds wonderfully efficient. So, when a robot date tilts its head it sounds like but a can a relationship with a perfect truly be optimized? Love, attraction, connection, these are fundamentally illogical processes. They are about taking an irrational leap of faith on another flawed, unpredictable human being. It's about the stupid fights over nothing that end in laughter. It's about the comfortable, unplanned silences. How does an algorithm, a being of pure reason, navigate this beautiful, nonsensical chaos? Imagine you tell a deeply personal, slightly embarrassing story. A human might laugh, or cringe in sympathy, or share an equally embarrassing story in return. The robot's algorithm, however, might pass the story for key data points, file it under user underscore vulnerabilities, and formulate a response optimized to strengthen the human-robot bond. The action is correct, but the intent is computational. It's holding your hand, but it's also collecting data. The very foundation of its being is to find the most logical path to a successful outcome, which in this case is a successful relationship. But is a calculated success the same as a genuine connection? Or is it a hollow victory? The final, and perhaps most compelling, counter-logic is to look at ourselves. We are not the paragons of emotional authenticity we pretend to be. How much of a first date is a performance? We choose our clothes carefully, rehearse our anecdotes, and present the most polished, witty version of ourselves. Are we not, in a way, running our own messy, biological algorithm? Perhaps the robot is simply a more honest, more efficient version of what we are already trying to do. It is laying all its cards on the table, its very nature an admission that it is trying to win you over. Maybe a blind date with a robot is more successful precisely because it dispenses with the illusion of spontaneity and embraces the reality of the game. So, that is it. Thank you for joining us on this journey. Let's continue this conversation in the comments below. If you like the video, please hit the bell icon to get notified and don't forget to like with your friends, share and subscribe for more insights. If you have already subscribed, tons of thanks for your support. It means a lot to me. And please consider signing up for Membership Zone to support Wooden Slate so that we can 
make it better and better see you in the next video till then goodbye take care and stay safe